Good morning students. Welcome to final part of the fourth standard first lesson. Final part of the fourth standard first lesson. So what is the first lesson name? Numbers beyond 9999. Today's our topic is Roman numerals. What is our today's topic? Our today's topic is Roman numerals. Roman numeral system. In this Roman numeral system, today we are going to see Roman numerals and the Hindu Arabic numerals. Listen my children, Hindu Arabic numerals we use only 10 symbols 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 to represent all the numbers, to write all the numbers. Tell me what is that Hindu Arabic numerals? 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, the next one is 8 and the final one is 9. So we use this 10 symbols to write all the Hindu Arabic numerals. But in the Roman numeration system, we have only 7 symbols. Listen that symbols. 1, V, X, L, C, D, E, M. 1, V, X, L, C, D, E, M. So 1 is represent 1 and V is 5. X is 10, L is 50, C is 100, D is 500 and finally M is 1000. So we use the 7 symbols to write all the Roman numeration system. But Hindu Arabic numeration system we use this 10 symbols 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. So everyone clear? Listen my children. In this Roman numeration system, there is no zero. Okay, there is no zero. We have one important difference is there. The Roman numeration system and the Hindu Arabic numeration system. In this Hindu Roman numeration system, we does not use the concept of the place value. We does not use the concept of the place value. Say what is the seven Roman numerals? One, V, X. So what is the next numeral guy three? Yes, one V X. L, C, D, M. Okay. So, 1 is 1 and V is 5. And what is X? X is 10. L is 50. C is 100. D is 500. And M is 1000. M is 1000. Listen, children. Some important points is there. Just you keep in your mind. Listen. In Roman numeration system, repetition of a symbol in Roman numeration system, repetition of a symbol is not allowed more than three times. Is not allowed more than three times. So, for example, if you are studying third standard, so third standard A section, you are writing one, 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 third A. If you are going to the fourth standard, means how you are writing the standard and section? Listen, you are written like this one. V A. Yes now listen. So why we do, do not write four times one 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 one. So if you are written like this means it is wrong. Why? Because the rules is a repetition of symbol is not allowed more than three times. More than three times. Only it is allowed three times only. Okay. It is allowed three times. Okay, 1 means what? It is denoted 1. 1 is the Indo Arabic numeral for 1 is 1. So, this is 1 and V is denoted 5. V is denoted 5. So, listen 1 V. If you are written smaller numeral to the right side of left side of the greater numeral means that is subtraction. If you are written smaller numerals to the Left side of the greater numeral means that is subtraction. Right side of the greater numeral means that is addition. Okay. So, 5 minus 1. 5 minus 1. So, the answer is 4. What is the answer? 4. So, you are studying 4th standard A section. The answer is 4. Okay, children. The next one is the symbol VLDR can't be repeated. The symbol V, L, D, R can't be repeated. So, what is the Hindu Arabic numeral for V? Yeah, that is 5. So, L is 50 and finally D is 500. D is 500. So, what is the rule means? The symbol V, L, D, R can't be repeated. Can't be repeated and subtracted. Never subtracted. So, what are the symbols? 
V L D. So what is the Hindu Arabic numerals? Five, fifty, and five hundred. Five, fifty, and five hundred. Yeah. The first topic is write the Hindu Arabic numerals. Write the Hindu Arabic numerals for the following numbers. Write the Hindu Arabic numerals for the following numbers. The first question is four. One V. Listen, my children. One V. So here V is denoted five. V is denoted five, and one is denoted one. So already you know that one is denoted the first Roman the Hindu Arabic numeral is one, and V is denoted five. Okay. So take one V equal to. I told you now when you return. Okay. If the smaller numeral is if the smaller numeral is written to the left side of the greater numeral written to the left side of the greater numeral that is subtraction that is what subtraction so take the greater numeral in first place and minus smaller numeral in second place so 5 minus 1 what is the answer the answer is 4 finally answer 1 v equal to 4 For example, next we will see the one more example. Listen, six. Okay, listen, my children. Here we are written smaller numeral in right side of the greater numeral. Smaller numeral in right side of the greater numeral. So tell me, what is the Hindu Arabic numeral of V? Yeah, five. And one is one. Take V one equal to five plus one. So five in the mind, one in the finger. What is the answer? Five after six. What is the answer? Six. So six equal to six. The final answer is six. Our next example is listen here. Thirty-eight x x x v one one one. Okay. So now we are going to split and write the answer. Take first here. First three x's, x x x. Then you will write eight separately. Okay. So what is the Hindu Arabic numeral for x? Okay. The Hindu Arabic numeral for x is ten. Right? Ten plus another ten plus ten. Ten plus ten plus ten. So your v is denoted five plus. So this is three. Take and write three. Okay. Now we are going to add this. Ten plus ten plus ten. What is the answer? Ten plus ten equal to twenty. Ten plus ten equal to twenty. Ten plus ten equal to what is the answer? Zero plus zero zero. One plus one two. Okay. Next we are going to take the another ten plus ten. Now zero plus zero zero two plus one three. So the answer is thirty. What is the answer? Thirty equal to five plus three. Five in the mind, three in the finger. Five in the mind, three in the finger. What is the answer? Five after six seven eight. Five after six seven eight. So the answer is eight. Now we are going to take and write the question. What is the question? X X X V one 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 right? So what is the triple X value? X X X. So you got the answer is thirty. Thirty plus here the answer is eight. Thirty plus eight. So take thirty and plus eight. Zero plus eight. Zero in the mind. Eight in the finger. You are getting. Same answer. The answer is eight and three. Okay. So the final answer is thirty-eight. Final answer is thirty-eight. So the Roman numeral x x x e one 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 equal to thirty-eight. The Hindu Arabic numeral for this answer is thirty-eight. So finally write the answer thirty-eight. Thirty-eight. Next we will see the. Next topic. Nine 
yeah what's the next topic or uh, before topic is write the hindu arabic numerals now this topic is write the roman numerals write the roman numerals they are given indo arabic numeral you are going to find the roman numerals listen the first question is 14 the first question is 14 now we are going to split this while splitting the number here you should use the expanded form here you should use the expanded form listen expanded form this is ones place and this is tens place right first you are going to write the tens place value so write the tens place value 1 1 occupied in the tens place so 1 into 10 the answer is 10 10 plus and 4 it will be in the ones place so write 4 okay 10 plus 4 what is the roman numeral for 10 tell me roshan yeah very good the roman numeral for 10 is x plus what is the roman numeral for 4 the roman numeral for 4 is 1 v just remove the plus symbol and write the roman numerals x 1 v so write the answer x 1 v x1 v next we will see the one more example for example 25 i'll take 25 okay so what is the first step first you should use the expanded form take 20 plus 5 20 plus 5 so what is the roman numeral for 10 so the roman numeral for 10 is x appa 20 means x plus x simply you take x into x plus so what is the roman numeral for 5 the roman numeral for 5 is v what is the roman numeral for 5 the roman numeral of 5 is v so v just you remove the plus symbol and take and write the answer so the roman numeral for 25 is x x v the roman numeral for 14 is x 1 v right a next topic fill in the blanks fill in the blanks and put less than or greater than or equal to fill in the blanks and put less than greater than or equal to less than greater than or equal to listen my children the first question is they are given a roman numerals and a hindu arabic numerals so compare this one x 1 v x 1 v so take x v 1 x v 1 here x is 10 v is 5 and 1 is 1 right now we are going to add this all the one 10 in the mind 5 in the finger 10 in the mind 10 plus 5 plus 1 10 in the mind 5 in the finger what is the answer 10 after 11 12 13 14 15 15 in the mind one in the finger so what is the answer the answer is 16 what is the answer 16 now you write here 16 here 14 here 16 and here 14 so which one is the greatest number yeah 16 is the greatest number so put the symbol like this okay children and next one is x x 1 v equal dash 26 x x 1 v okay x x 1 v so here the roman numeral for x equal to what is the answer hindu arabic numeral 10 take 10 plus 10 plus 4 10 plus 10 plus 4 so 10 in the mind 10 in the finger the answer is 20 20 plus 4 24 20 plus 4 24 what is the answer 24 so now you take and write here 24 and here 26 here 24 and here 26 so compare this two number which one is the greatest number 26 is the greatest number so put the symbol like this okay children our next example is 39 39 so the both are equal so put the equal symbol what is the symbol equal symbol so our final topic is which which of the following are meaningless which of the following are meaningless listen already you know 
the repetition of symbol is more than how many times alone three times only alone okay so this is meaningless this is meaningless this is called x 1 x so x is denoted 10 1 x is denoted 9 so 10 plus 9 the answer is 19 10 plus 9 the answer is 19 so this is meaning meaning okay the next one is x v v and from the first line itself you know we do not repeat and subtract and v l d so this is meaningless this is what meaningless next you will take x is denoted 10 and another x is denoted 10 v is denoted 5 so the answer is 25 what is the answer 25 so listen children in this exercise you will learn write the roman numerals and hindu arabic numerals write the roman numerals to hindu arabic numerals hindu arabic numerals to roman numerals i hope everyone enjoy this section so listen in this below description we have what is study material question bank and self assessment work today itself we completed first lesson numbers beyond 9999 do the self assessment work daily and then you should if you have any doubt you should go through this video again and again thank you my dear students